Ripple Edge editing has been a requested feature in the Reaper forum for a long time. A quick Google search returns threads that date back as long as 2007. The ability to ripple the other items when editing the edges of an item is an essential feature, especially when working with speech or video. But it may have its uses when editing music too. As a user said back in 2011, most people don't know they want it. If the lack of this feature makes you resort to other digital audio workstations when editing speech or video, there is no need anymore. Ripple Edge editing for Reaper is here with Amagalma's script. Let's have a quick look at the feature set. The script supports both rippling modes and integrates with Reaper almost as tightly as a native feature would, with minimal CPU use and a relatively fast visual response. Edge rippling can either follow Reaper's current working paradigm of only rippling to the right side, or even ripple to the left side, a behavior that is not supported natively. You can easily toggle the way the script works with the companion script. You may choose to always maintain the left edge position, resulting in rippling items always to the right side, or enable left side rippling. If you prefer to always edit in a certain way, then you can force that behavior inside the script. The state of the companion script will no longer have any effect. While the script is enabled, items that will ripple will be colored for your convenience. You can set the color you prefer inside the script, or you can even disable coloring if you wish. The script supports rippling items that crossfade, snapping, rippling while stretching items, multiple item selection, Envelopes, automation items, markers and regions, master track envelopes, all are fully supported. In case your preferred behavior is to allow left edge rippling, then sometime you may face the situation of not having any more space to the left, as the project start is fixed. Do not worry. The script will automatically move everything to the right, always keeping the relative positions intact, in order to make space for you. It even notifies you of what is going to happen by coloring the items that hit the project start wall. You can even set this color to the color of your choice inside the script. When resizing multiple items of different sizes, you may come across the situation of the smallest item ending to be really tiny, almost zero length. This is something that Reaper natively does not prevent. This script prevents this situation by stopping resizing when the smallest item reaches a certain length. You can set this length inside the script to your preference. In order to tightly integrate with Reaper and offer a more native feature-like experience, the script respects the following Reaper settings. Envelope points move with media items. Add edge points when ripple editing or inserting time. Transition time for automatically created envelope edge points. You can buy the script by contacting user Amagalma at the Reaper forums. That's all for now. Take care of yourselves and stay healthy.